Hello everyone, welcome to Halo Moon Tarot. This is your weekly love reading for Taurus. Hope you guys are well, thanks for dropping in. If you haven't seen the singles readings I did on Monday, you can check those out in my playlist. There's one for each zodiac sign. You'll also notice I have the magician in the world here, and it's because I want that energy. I want to see what's manifesting, whether it's you or someone coming towards you, and the changes this will bring, all right, where this may lead. So, Taurus. What does Taurus need to know? Well, their love life, clear messages, and guidance for Taurus. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, you got somebody rushing towards you. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, you have... You have the King of Wands. You have the Knight of Cups. Justice. Oh, somebody's coming in to talk to you. They're taking the lead. And they're coming in right. I see Libra. Aries, Leo, Sag. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. So, yeah, there's somebody here who possibly had one foot in the door and one foot out at some point, okay? Or it's somebody who wants to take you on a date. They're taking the lead. This person's very focused, very motivated, very determined uh, to do things right. Wow. Yeah, this is somebody coming in in a balanced manner, balancing that passion, <laughs> that drive, that ambition is what, and their emotions. So, very nice. Yes, very nice. So, I, this person is definitely... Uh, someone who will stand up for themselves, they'll stand up for you. They are a little bit guarded, a little bit guarded, you know, I can see that energy, Taurus. Let's see, whoops, there we go, boy, these cards want to fly, yeah, there's something transforming here, some kind of transformation, whoops, get these out, these two came out, yeah, balance, so, yeah, there's somebody who's coming in in a balanced manner, they're balancing out that passion, that emotion, they want to communicate, they're taking action, this is someone who doesn't give up though, but they're doing things right, okay, for some of you, it could be somebody coming in to make things right, you might not believe this person, you might be a little guarded, but that is a tra that's going to come to an end. Something is going to transform. Somebody is coming in and bringing balance. There is some balance between you and someone. Someone sees you as just right, you may see them that way. They're very sexy, charming. Okay, so someone who's very, it could be a man or a woman, it doesn't matter, but that King of Wands is that sheer determination. This is somebody who um, may make a bit <laughs> a big production out of it, but there is going to be some emotion. I see a date, someone who's very determined, and they want everything to go just right. They see you as just right, feel like you may see them that way. I see balance. So somebody who's kind of pulled back, looking at things differently, and it could be yourself, Taurus, okay? Yeah, sort of pulling back and looking things. This person may be different than your usual type, okay? They may approach you in a different way. You may feel a little guarded. You're not so sure, but I feel like you'll come out of that energy. I think you and this person could have a lot of chemistry. You could actually balance each other out as things transform. Like as this develops with this person, see, there's that world. Yeah, this could go somewhere. Very nice, yeah. There could be a very strong connection between you and this person. Uh, they could have some Leo in their chart. Very strong, very determined, very brave. And they want somebody is determined that this to move forward. Okay, this somebody is very determined to just go with the flow, just keeping themselves balanced because they want to make sure this works out. They want justice. They want balance. And there they are going to come in right. Okay. They got some fire, possibly some Libra, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Definitely, possibly a Scorpio or Leo. Uh, maybe Sag for some of you. Yes, very nice. So let's have a couple more cards for Taurus. Do they need to know about their love life? Oops, there we go. Yeah, so you do have somebody here who's definitely coming towards you. Someone here is trying to figure out. Someone's chasing you before you can get away. Okay. <laughs> you might have a few people. It sort of looks like you got a couple people. So this could be a couple of people headed your way, but someone's definitely chasing you. They don't want you to get away. They want to communicate. They want to move forward. So you could, it could be someone that has had one foot in the door and out. They kind of wanted things their way. Maybe they weren't really interested in, in commitment, but it kind of looks like this person has transformed. They've pulled back. They've changed their mind. Uh, something has changed in them, and I feel it's because there's something that they're figuring out. And I feel this person is chasing out, going to chase you. 
you may have someone who's a player here as well okay so i kind of feel you may have an aries leo or sag around you that could be a bit of a player you might feel a bit defensive you could have some of that energy in your own chart but most of the time with this i see somebody who's chasing after you they're taking everything that they know being strong and brave this is someone who isn't going to give up and i feel like you got someone who is headed your way with this information they gather they want to communicate they want to get to know you more uh, they're going to want to know more they know some things about you most definitely i can see they know some things but they don't know everything <laughs> so yeah they need to figure out if you're just the right person or not it also could be yourself taurus trying to take that time to figure out if they're the right person but i see this i mean this could be somebody who you were a bit guarded or defensive about in the past or you just weren't sure if you believed it would transform and go where you wanted it's very very likely that uh, you're pulling back yourself and seeing this person different than before and you've changed your mind you may let this person come in it very well could be you going through this as well but they are definitely um headed your way i can tell you that they want they know they know some things they're going to take the things that they know and chase you <laughs> they're not letting you get away okay yeah they're very strong very determined they're going to be very brave so yeah there is a cycle ending and a new cycle beginning maybe some Pisces energy. So you have someone here who's kind of kept some of their feelings to themselves. Okay. You may, your intuition may tell you, you know who this is. This is someone who wants things to go in their favor. And I feel as though this person's quite intuitive. They know, they know some things about you. They, this person knows some things. Uh, they know a lot about you, but not everything. And I, I, it's interesting because this is someone who wants to get to know you more. They want to grow closer to you. This person's coming. Uh, whoever they are, it's the time is. It, it's telling me it's coming. Okay, uh, it, the the distance is get is going like this, closer and closer. Whoever this is, so interesting enough. Yeah. So I feel as though there's some kind of cycle that's ended. Some kind of, somebody here wants things to go in their favor. They're determined. They want justice. And I feel they're definitely trusting their intuition. Okay. They know they're going within. They know some things about you. You probably know who this is. Tell me about this. You you, you may. Whoops. That, did, that was supposed to come out. Hold on here. There we go. Oh, no. Where did it go? There it is. Yeah, I've seen that come out. So, yeah, I feel as though what's... This person's taking action. They're coming in to fight for you, okay? Uh, they're not afraid of the competition at all. Uh, they know that there may be competition, that they may have to uh, really fight, okay? This is person's coming in for action. And yeah, they don't want to, they don't want you to move on towards another person. Uh, they want to get you before you get away. <laughs> They just want to get to know you more. They want things to move forward calmly and peacefully and just go with the flow, okay? They feel this strength. They feel there's something here that's worth exploring with the world, right? With Worth moving forward with. Really nice. Tell me about justice. Why is this here? What's justice about? There we go. Yeah, so this person definitely wants to start something. And they want to start it just right. They're going to express themselves, expose their feelings. They're going to put it all out there. It's very illuminating. So, wow, this person sees you very clearly. They know what they need to know, okay? And they want to. They know enough to come in and take action. They may know you have people competing for you as well. Uh, they're prepared to fight. <laughs> They want justice. They want this right. They see you as the right person. So, wow. They they may have some Leo. I do see some strong Leo in their chart. They could be a Leo. Uh, yeah, so there there's this protective mode, a little bit blocked, not sure what to believe. Okay, you're kind of sitting here, kind of holding back. <laughs> uh, you got this pentacle on your head here. And you got the three of pentacles, which is teamwork, cooperation, compromise. There's something holding you back, keeping you stuck here uh, to do with this. But you're looking at the details of this. And I think there's something here that you're going to change your mind. You're going to pull back and see this. I think this person's just different, okay, than your usual type. Uh, or they're going to come towards you in a different way. And you may have a hard time believing it. Like, are you kidding me? Because they're coming in just like this with the sun, with justice. Doing everything just right. It might be a little too good to be true. 
I do see them being a little different than your usual type, but you're going to come out of this stuck mode, this protective mode, this holding back, okay? Because there's something here that's kind of keeping you stuck, and that's on the top of the head here, all right? This is to do with teamwork. This is a lack of teamwork, cooperation, compromise, because you're not so sure. You're a little guarded. Tell me about transformation. Yeah, so there is definitely this need for safety, security, and stability. Uh, you want someone who's just right. You want to make sure everyone, everything is right. You are worried about that as well. I can see it. You're a little in protective mode, okay? And that's what I see. You want someone who has your back. You want a partner, someone to build a legacy with. Two people who build, right? This is two people right here who build, go off on the same path to build something. And I think you got this person's difference. You may not see it. So you're holding back and making sure they're stable and you can rely on them. But this is going to transform. I, I think this person, you're going to come out of this. You're not going to be stuck anymore. I think you have someone here. Uh, there's balance. There's chemistry. Two people who balance each other out. So whatever that means to you, tell me about this balance. Yeah, there you are. Yeah, wow. Empress energy. Yeah, this person's pulling back. They're seeing you you different possibly than their than other people they've been with. They see you as this empress, very sexy, very sensual. They see you very clearly. Okay. Yes, they think that you are the one. <laughs> this person's willing to fight for you. And that's what you want. You want someone to show you this. You're holding back. You know, you're not going to believe everything they say. You're going to hold back and look out for you. You're going to look at all the details. But you're this person's going to change your mind. They do have your back. And uh, they see you as someone who has their back. It's right in the middle. And wow. I mean, this could be somebody uh, that kind of had one foot in the door and out for a while. It might have been a little on and off. It's possible. And, it, you know, it doesn't look like... When I see a breakup or anything, um, I mean, possibly this person kind of, maybe there was competition or some kind of argument to something was exposed, but I, I feel it's positive. I feel that this person is very clear. They see you as the one. They see justice. They see you as that person, and, but you're not so sure, but you're going to pull back and look at it. I think you're going to be quite surprised, but look at that. This is that temperance, balance, chemistry. Um, the, this person really likes you you have all the energy they want taurus taurus and libra that's yourself possibly if you have libra in your chart yeah they they like you a lot yeah they see you as that empress and you're valuing yourself loving yourself first you want somebody to come in they have to come in right this person knows to do that they you know they're not afraid to fight for what they want and wow they don't care if there's competition <laughs> No, I don't see this person caring. They know when they want, this is someone that goes after what they want, okay? So we have the world. Oof, nice reading, Taurus. Yeah, if you've been holding back, protecting yourself, kind of being grounded, just making sure, you you know, anyone who comes in, they balance you out, they have your back. Yeah, it's going to take a little work. This could be somebody you worked with. Uh, some time ago. Uh, I feel this person wants this to go with the flow. They're going to put the work in. Yeah, this person's not afraid of hard work. I can tell you. You may have worked with them. I see this working out. They see it. I think you're going to see it working out too. Uh, I think you're just sort of in that uh, looking out for yourself here with the Empress energy, uh, making sure, right, that they are like that, that you feel safe, that you feel comfortable with them, they balance your life out. Uh, this is love. Um, the Empress is love. Yeah, there's this person taking a leap of faith. Someone's, they, they could be an Aries for some of you taking that risk. It could be yourself. You may have some of that energy in your chart. Regardless, this is reflecting on the past. One look over your shoulder. Yeah, you see this evolving. You see this working out. It could be someone from your past that you worked with. Okay, very nice. You're going to go for this. I think it's this person, honestly. I, uh, Regardless of whether they're Aries, Leo, Sag, or even Scorpio, they're taking that risk, that leap. Yeah, they, they aren't going to let you get away. No, it's, it's like, it's, it's sort of like a now or never Tell me about this seven of swords. There we go. Yeah, see this person here, they don't want to miss an opportunity. They may have missed an opportunity with you before. Maybe they rejected you or, 
uh, vice versa, whatever it is, they're, they're doing things the right way and they see you as the one. Wow, it could be a lot of different people here. I, you know, I see a lot of different energies. I see um, Taurus. Wow, this person is, yeah, they are a little worried about being rejected, but they're going to take this risk anyway. They're gaining that strength, that confidence. They're very confident now that this can work out, you see. Could be somebody that you dated, like I said, that was on and off, and they weren't very confident it would work out before, that it would actually go anywhere. Could be yourself as well, a little of that energy. So I see you looking out for yourself, being the empress. So I feel, I mean, it could be you pulling back and seeing this person different. Uh, maybe they're coming in different. Maybe they're, um, they have your back. They're going to show you that they're reliable, that they want to commit. This is something solid. So, wow. Like, wow. <laughs> this person isn't going to miss another opportunity. And it could be you. You may have missed an opportunity. But like, you've got to watch that. Balance your Empress energy as well. Because sometimes when you're in that Empress energy, you have a tendency, sometimes, not always, to... Hold yourself up there, you know, because you're in protective mode, protecting yourself a bit too much. Um, definitely focused on your money. I can see a lot of abundance around you. You're balancing. I think you're ready to balance love and work. And I see a lot of creative energy, new beginnings. I see this person seeing you this way. But I, that just little bit of warning I'm getting. Like, be careful because uh, you may miss an opportunity if you're afraid to take a leap of faith as well. So just trust your intuition. This is going to go in your favor. I do. I think something is really beautiful is happening. And uh, there's this offer. Yeah, someone's coming back around. So yeah, this person's not missing another opportunity. They're offering you that great big cup. Uh, fresh new start could be a new person as well and they may be just different than your usual type so kind of pull back and you may feel like something's off something's not right okay and get into protective mode okay and kind of hold back a little but they're going to work for you this person's going to fight for you they're not going to give up okay they want you yeah there's that cup of love <laughs> Yeah, this person's definitely ready to let this evolve. Uh, they want this to go somewhere. They're going to share their feelings with you. And uh, this is a, it could be a new person as well. It doesn't have to be someone that had their foot in the door. It could be someone who's finally decided to come in and offer you that date uh, to make that communication, to take that action. Uh, they're going to show you that they're ready, right? This is someone with sheer determination. They're going to expose all of that. It's all going to be illuminated. It very well could be a, a new... You may end something with someone who has their foot in and out the door, and then you got this person coming in, uh, coming in to fight for you, to take that action. Maybe they're, you know, you've let something go. Uh, I do see a... They kind of Pisces in their chart. Aries, Leo, Sag, or Scorpio. That's interesting, that combination as well. Yeah, so... I, I Yeah, there's that magician energy, Taurus. Yeah, somebody here is definitely manifesting... Somebody here wants to get on, they're manifesting to get on the same page. They want to manifest commitment to marriage. And this is what you want. So it's telling you to keep the faith. Somebody is coming around who has all the tools you need. They're on the same page, the same path, uh, same everything. It's very balanced. Yeah, wow. This person knows what they need to do. They know what they want. And uh, it's telling you to keep the faith. Wow. Wow. Could be a Gemini Taurus cusp, a Taurus uh, to yourself as well. They could have they could have some Taurus in their chart, but you are you are manifesting, keeping the faith. You want commitment, and you're getting it because you're valuing yourself. But your gut is telling you to be balanced. Okay, to if you feel like someone's different than the usual type, just sort of pull back and look at them. Try to look at them from a different angle, a different perspective. Uh, because there is a lot of chemistry, okay? I, I think this person's probably just right for you, and vice versa, Taurus. So tell me about the world. Yeah, you know what you want. It feels like you've all kind of gone through that energy of balancing yourself out and uh, holding yourself in high regard, valuing everything that you've worked hard for, because when you've become the Empress, you've gone through all the lessons of the Queens. You now know what to manifest, how to manifest. You have all the tools you need to manifest love. You have everything. And someone sees you that way as well. They see you as a faithful person too. 
very traditional. You want that traditional kind of relationship to people who build something beautiful. Uh, this is, you know, this is going off on that path to build something beautiful. Two people having each other's backs, looking out for each other. Nice. Yeah, this could go somewhere. So this person definitely uh, is not going to let you walk away. But you see, there's that two of cups. Uh, they definitely want to get to know you a little more. It might take them a little bit of time for this to evolve, for them to tell you they love you. But they're offering you this big cup, this, uh, this opportunity. And I think if you reject this, it's telling you to balance yourself. You could miss an opportunity, but I think they don't want to miss an opportunity. I mean, it's possible uh, they kind of held back at some point and they weren't sure maybe about their feelings and it's taken this person a little time to figure out that they absolutely adore you. Wow. It's kind of what it looks like for the most part. So let's see where this goes. You're headed towards emotional fulfillment. This is going to evolve. Two of Cups coming up. Actually, let's go on that a little bit more here. Tell me about this Eight of Cups. Yeah. Yeah, weighing the pros and the cons. Yeah, you want to make sure whoever comes in, they're balanced, right? Look at that. Standing up for yourself, very focused. You know exactly what you want. So if you don't get what you want, you will walk away. Okay, but it's also telling you, if you walk away from this person, watch yourself, okay? You're definitely focused on career, finances. You want someone who focuses on you. And you're going to sit and kind of weigh the pros and the cons. So it's telling you to be cautious about the decision that you make to walk away. You could miss an opportunity. Don't. Just make sure, you know, I do feel they value you. And I do. They see you as the empress. They see that you're just right. The, you, you couldn't be any more perfect is the way they see you. But something here makes you kind of pull back. Like it's almost too good to believe in a way. Okay, because the Empress is no fool, let me tell you, okay? <laughs> Reflecting on the past, is this going to work? I think it's someone you worked with. Maybe you, they traveled for work. It could be somebody um, moving into your neighborhood. Somebody wants us to move forward. They want to put the work in. Let's see what that Eight of Pentacles is. Oops. Yeah, so you got somebody here is very focused on themselves, focused on creativity. Okay, so yeah, I kind of feel as though you're changing your mind about somebody here. Yeah, you got two people here. You got people competing for your attention. Uh, but this person who's coming in to fight for you, to express themselves, to start, this new person is the one you're going to go for. So it looks like a new person. It looks like this could be someone with one foot in and out the door and you're ending it and going for someone new. There's a new cycle starting. Trust your intuition. You may be feeling like something's happening. You may know everything you already need to know about this person. You may not believe them. It looks like my readings are going like this today. It's the strangest thing. The last reading did that too. So, wow. Yeah, I think you got someone here who's a little immature, focused on themselves, their work. You may feel like it's not going to work. You're reflecting on something. You could be comparing uh, somebody from the past to this new person. They may pull back you may feel there's something similar or something off but i i think they're just a little different than your usual type or they're seeing you that way so interesting enough yeah you're very brave very powerful very strong uh it's sort of a you will walk away from somebody if they don't come in balance or they try to throw you off balance but i think this is you standing up for what you want you, you definitely have some of this Aries Leo Sag energy yourself. There's definitely a compatibility. Uh, Hardworking, dedicated, very focused. <laughs> Look at that. Yes. Yeah, very driven, very creative energy. So you're, I think you're comparing two people. I think you're going to end up with someone who uh, could be someone you worked with that's focused on themselves, focused on that passionate energy, because I see you kind of looking at it. You may have Aries in your chart. Don't have to. It's just that energy, okay, uh, about not t being a fool, not taking the lip, uh, leap of faith, being very strong and going to go for this other person who's coming in to take a risk towards you. So you got some stuff going on here, Taurus. And if it hasn't all started yet, it's probably going to uh, get going. But if you are ending something with someone who has their, you know, they just want romance. They have one foot in and out the door and they're just focused on themselves. That's not going anywhere. It's not going to work. You're not going to put the work into that. No, you want someone who works for you, not someone who's focused on themselves. And this could be an energy too of somebody.
is all they've been doing is focus, focusing on themselves and work. There's no play. They may be also, it could be them coming in to take a leap, ready to put that kind of thing in the past. Um, it doesn't mean they're immature or just focused on passion. Uh, when I see this, it's also somebody who's focused on work and creativity. They're always focused on doing their own thing, and it could be you as well, okay? Uh, ready to let go, to be strong, to go for love. It's time for love. It's coming, whether you like it or not. <laughs> it's headed your way. And I, I like the person that's coming in to fight for you. They're not afraid to fight for what they want. They're coming in to take the lead. And that's what you want is that leader. But you also want that emotional connection. And I think it'll take a little time. They're going to offer you this fresh new start. Okay, plant that seed. Be careful if you reject them, right? You may miss an opportunity. But this person, it will evolve and they will eventually uh, share all their love with you. And I don't think it'll take long. I see this moving rather quickly. So yeah, there's a new beginning here. Yeah, you've got a new person. So you're. it does look like you could be letting somebody go. And somebody else is jumping into action. Somebody definitely sees you as a keeper. Uh, this is somebody who will stand up for you. Someone will have your back. Somebody who's strong and brave, right? Like that's what you want and that's what you're about to get. Oh, Taurus. Yes, man or woman, you know. Uh, everybody wants that partner, that person will fight for them, that person who's there for them, uh, that rock, right, that stability. So beautiful. Taurus, Taurus, yeah. So there is that protection. So you have a new person coming in. You feel a little in protective mode, okay? But you want someone who protects you and looks after you. You want somebody who is there for you when you need them. And that's what you need is this energy with this person. So be careful you don't miss an opportunity by protecting yourself too much, holding back, because it may feel like too good to be true. They may come on very strong. So just trust your gut. Yeah, it'll tell you. Trust that intuition. There we go. Yeah, wisdom. Be wise. Yeah, there's some. Be wise. You see this energy? It's very deep emotional energy. Okay. Beautiful. See that mermaid swimming way down there into those deep emotions? And it could be something you need to let go of. Okay. Uh, where you kind of protect yourself. Lots of people do that when they first meet someone. Just don't reject this. You may, like it could be you missing an opportunity, but I actually feel like it's this person because you may have just ended something, okay? And uh, this person, they could have Pisces in their chart. They may already know this and keeping it to themselves. <laughs> Uh, but I definitely see them being fiery. So there is abundance, yeah. Let things blossom and bloom. There's going to be some deep feelings here. This person may keep them to themselves a little bit until they know. It might throw you off and you might not be sure, but that's okay. Yeah, take courage, all right? Be brave, be strong. Uh, something is blossoming here with this abundance. Someone sees you this way. I feel they have a lot of abundance as well. Yeah, I think this person's going to be okay but you just trust yourself it's your decision your judgment here so yeah illumination wait for everything to be illuminated out into the open and it will i can see this person doing things right expressing themselves putting themselves out there everything is going to become very clear they will make it clear they see you as the one this is a person fighting for what they want the person that they want the person of their dreams so yeah, this is about taking a risk, right? Make sure, don't take that risk, right? You're going to reflect on other people, past situations, uh, comparing apples to oranges, okay? There's something here you're going to have to release and let go of. Uh, there, It could be this person as well, right? Uh, but I think you're letting go of one person that's coming towards you or from the past yeah i think so so there are some you have some trust issues possibly as well so make sure everything is illuminated once it is and you get the clarity you need from this new person it's like that when you meet a new person you don't always trust them right off the get-go right so yeah, you're going through those motions so yeah saying to be patient this person will share their feelings this will evolve they're going to offer the cup. It'll take a little time to evolve, and this person will, because they are cautious. The King of Cups can be a little cautious. They need a little more time to get to know you. They want to grow closer to you. 
So very, I see this moving forward quite calmly, quite peacefully. Uh, I think this is somebody where this really could go somewhere. It's quite lovely, Taurus. So I wish you the best. Keep the faith. You have all the tools you need. Make sure you have all the information you're learning. This is about the stuff you've learned from your past, where you're going to weigh the pros and the cons, compare this person to somebody else. But they are different. So make sure you pull back and look at that. Okay, reflecting before you leap into it. But look, at I think you're going to go for it. I think they are too. Uh, it's lovely. So take care. I wish you the best. And bye for now.